Welcome to a video segment of the Albuquerque Police Department's 2011 Annual Report. My name is Erica Wilson. I'm the Emergency Communications Center Manager for the City of Albuquerque. And welcome to the report for 2011 for what occurred in the center. In 2011, this center handled almost 800,000 phone calls. That is a mixture of 911 and 242 COPS phone calls. Within that number of phone calls, it's a, about a 3% increase as compared to 2010. This center has approximately 135 employees that work 24-7, holidays, weekends, and so on. And we try to achieve performance standards on how we answer the 911 calls. The national standard for answering 911 phone calls is that 90% of 911 calls are answered within 10 seconds. The City of Albuquerque had established a goal of 92.5% and in 2011 the goal was increased to 93.73%. We answered 93.12% of the 911 calls in 2011, so just slightly below the Albuquerque goal but well above the national standard. With the 800,000 phone calls that we answered over the year, there were a half million CAD events entered in the system, and those are the calls that are entered for the officers to respond to. So this center is always busy. In the background behind me, you will notice that there are dispatch terminals where we have employees training, and you will see that um, we've continued to hire. In 2011, we hired new employees and we're hiring an even bigger class in 2012 of 12 employees that will help us increase that answering ring time standard. And so we'll have 12 new hires coming on in February of 2012. The other things that were accomplished in 2011 is we installed a $1.8 million new telephone system which the employees used to answer the 911 and 242 COPS phone calls. This upgrade allowed us to bring to the center the state-of-the-art technology that allowed us to um, filter and collect all this data. Uh, the upgrade certainly wasn't without a few bumps in the road, but the system has been stable and functioning well, and we're very pleased with it. With our vendor partners, we've worked out all the issues. We upgraded the entire system to improve the cameras and bring them to a digital standard instead of analog and increase the number of swipe badge access points to improve the security to the center so it's harder for people to access it without the proper authorization. As with a 911 center anywhere, the most important thing is employee retention. We continue to have a very low turnover compared to the national average. We're at about 12% for last year. We'd certainly like it to be lower, but the national standard can be anywhere from 19 to 50% turnover in a single year. So I'm proud of what the staff has accomplished here in training and retaining effective employees. We also had an employee retire last year who is one of our supervisors and in 2012 will be looking to fill that position. The other projects that were started in 2011 was a complete reformat and rewrite of our procedure book. We're heading towards CALEA certification as an independent communication center and it's important for the entire procedure book to be reviewed, rewritten, updated and that project's at about 50%. 2011 was a challenging year for the communication center with the upgrade of the phone system. It required employees to learn new software and be patient as the system went through upgrades and changes. They handled it very well and we didn't see a decrease in service. The employees, as always, continue to try and do their best for our callers. Citizens who call us are never calling on their best day and they try to provide the best customer service possible. The Emergency Communication Center appreciates the support of the chief, the council, the mayor, and everybody working for City of Albuquerque because we do work for you and you in turn support us and we thank you for that.